Hi everyone, welcome to my Phase 3 phonics lesson. We're going to first start by revisiting all the Phase 3 sounds. We'll start with the individual sounds by saying my name is and my sound is. Are you ready? Big voices and good looking. My name is J and my sound is J. My name is W and my sound is mm. My name is Z and my sound is Mm. My name is X and my sound is X. My name is V and my sound is V. My name is Y and my sound is Y. My name is J and my sound is J. My name is W and my sound is W. Now we're going to revisit all of our digraphs. Digraphs are two letters that make one sound. Sh, uh, al, z, uh, oi. Ah. This sound makes two different sounds. Uh, oo. O. E. A. Mm. Now we're going to revisit all of our trigraphs. Three letters that make one sound. I. Your air ear. The sound we're going to learn today is hiding in each one of these words. So we need to find the sound that is the same in each word. Can you help me put the sound buttons on to find out which sound is hiding in these words? Are you ready? S I Ng, sing. E, ng, ding. U, a, ng, bang. Have you spotted a sound that is the same in each one of the words? That's right, it's the ng sound which is made up of the letter M and G. It makes the ng sound. You can find ng in the middle of words and at the end of words, but never at the beginning. Can you think of any words that have the ng digraph in? I have the ng sound hiding in my pack. As soon as you see it, I want you to shout out with your loudest voice, ng. Are you ready? Make sure I don't catch you out. Ng. 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 Some words are going to appear at the bottom of the screen now. I need you to get your robot arms out and help me read each word. Are you ready? They all have the ng sound in them. S, I, ng, sing. I, ng, ping. R, I, ng. Ring. Make sure you've got a pen and a piece of paper because now we're going to practice our letter formation. What letters can you see in digraph ng? The letter N and the letter G. 
The letter N belongs to the one arm robot family. Start at the top of the robot, down, back up the robot and over his arm and back down. What letter family does G belong to? The curly caterpillar family. Curl around the caterpillar up and down. First it's my turn. I'm going to show you how to do it and then you can have a go all by yourself. Are you ready? Put your pen down. The first letter in diagraph N is the letter N. Start at the top, down the robot, back over his arm, down onto the line. My letters are sitting beautifully on the line. N and G. G is a curly caterpillar letter. Curl around the caterpillar, up and down. Why don't you press pause on the video and have a go all by yourself? What fantastic letter formation. Now that we've had plenty of practice, I think we're ready for a sentence challenge. I need to think of a sentence, say it, and then write it. Think it, say it, write it. I think I would like to write a sentence about my ring. Ring has the ng sound in it. So I'm going to think about my sentence. You can see that my ring is gold. So my sentence is going to be, the ring is gold. The ring is gold. Four words. My first word is the. Before I write my sentence, what do I need to make sure I write a super sentence? Clappity capital. Letters on the line, finger spaces and a full stop. The ring is gold. First word, the. T-H-E spells the. Tricky word, the. I'm going to make sure I put my capital. T-H-E spells the. My H tickles the top. The, the ring. I mustn't forget my finger space. The ring. Can you stretch out the word ring with me? Ring. Ring. We can robot talk it as well. Are you ready? Ring. Ring. What's the first letter in ring cube that you can hear? Ring. R sound, which is a one arm robot. Down the robot, back up and over his arm. R ing. I sound is next. Down and just a tiny dot on the top. R ing. The ng sound goes next, which is the N and G. Down. Bounce back up and over, one on robot letter, and curly caterpillar, G. Curl around the caterpillar, up and, oh dear, this is in the way, and down. The ring is, is, I can hear the I sound, I'm going to put my full stop, my full stop, my finger space there, I. Is curl around the caterpillar, give him a belly, and sit him on the line. Can you read your sentence with me? The ring is what colour did we say it was? Gold. That's right. Gold. Stretch out the word gold so that we can hear all of the sounds. Are you ready? G. Old. Gold. One more time. G old. Gold. What's the first sound you hear in gold? The g sound. Curl around the caterpillar up and down. Just like the g sound at the end. Gold. What's the next sound you can hear in gold? G oh. Oh. 
like uh, old. So you hear the ooh sound. Ooh. Good old. Hear the last sound. Good old. Old sound, which is a curly caterpillar letter. So be very careful not to get this one back to front. Curl around the caterpillar onto the line. Up, 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 up. Tickle the top and back down. And give him a tail. The ring is ruffled. I have a capital capital. Finger spaces. Letters on the line. I just need to remember my full stop. Which is the ring is gold. Can you put the sound buttons on each word in your sentence? And maybe you could think of your own sentence to write about a ring. Today we've learned all about digraph ng. It has the letter n in and the letter g, which makes the ng sound. You can find this sound in the middle and at the end of words, but never at the beginning. Remember, keep practicing. See you soon.